Peggy 3. Be a goalkeeper is a completely new way of playing EA Sports FIFA, where you're in control of the goalkeeper during the entire match. Goalkeeping is all about positioning, anticipation and timing. So be sure to learn the basics before you jump into a one-off match, a career or even to the online world for an 11 against 11 match. Let's talk about the basics. Move around with the left stick to stay in the position that better covers the goal. When the ball is coming, attempt to save by holding the right stick towards the direction you want to dive. Be careful that timing is really important. Attempt to dive too early and you'll lose your composure. Attempt to dive too late and the ball will end up in your net. Goalkeepers must face other difficult situations too. For in-air balls coming from crosses, press and hold the triangle button to charge the ball for a punch attempt. When the opponent is in the box facing you with the ball at his feet, rush out at him and dive at his feet by pressing the square button. Timing and positioning are really important here too. Attempt the actions at the wrong place or moment and you'll likely miss the ball, leaving an open net. As you can see, being a goalkeeper isn't an easy task. You save and you become a hero, or you miss and bite the dust. But don't get discouraged, a few hints are available for you during your learning process. When defending, an indicator on the pitch will show you the best position to cover the goal. When it's green, you're in a good spot. By pressing and holding the L1 button, your keeper will automatically move to that spot. To help you with the timing and the ball speed perception, a white trace will be shown indicating the trajectory of the ball, and a red trace will be shown representing its future trajectory. When defending your goal, a red indicator will appear on any opponent who is attempting a shot or header on goal. All these hints can be activated or deactivated in the game settings screen. As a goalkeeper, you have the advantage of having a great view of the entire pitch when your team is on the attack. This allows you to yell to your teammates to perform certain actions. Press the X button to yell to your teammate to call for a pass. Press the triangle button to yell to your teammate to call for a through pass. Press the square button to yell to your teammate to call for a cross. Press the circle button to yell to your teammate to shoot on goal. But as in real life, they won't always pay attention to you. Just keep in mind that if the view is too far for your eyes or you just fancy following the play from close by, you can simply press the select button to toggle zooming in and out with the camera. Learning to be a goalkeeper is not an easy task. You have to take it step by step. In game settings, you can try and play with the different assistance levels to see which one suits you best. We recommend you start with assisted and then move up to semi or manual one once you master the controls. For extra help, controls explained here and other additional controls can be found on the controller help screen. Well, that's more than enough for a start. You can start playing Be A Goalkeeper in practice mode. Once you feel confident, try it out in Be A Goalkeeper exhibition match. Master the position playing it in career mode. And once you're ready, attempt to become the most recognized goalkeeper in the online world in club matches. Remember, move with the left stick, dive holding the right stick.